have home remedies for infected ingrown toenails. Ingrown toenails only causes pain and discomfort. It also increases the risk of secondary toenail infection. Fortunately, ingrown toenails can be easily treated with the help of the simple home remedies by taking appropriate care of the affected toe in the early stages when the symptoms are mild not only helps in providing the fast relief but also helps in preventing the further complications. To get rid of the ingrown toenails fast, you can rely on the following home remedies. Number 1 is Turmeric. They can usually use only turmeric to get relief of the ingrown toenail discomfort such as pain, swelling and inflammation. The compound curcumin in turmeric has antiseptic, anti-inflammatory and pain relieving ability. Make a paste of a half teaspoon of the turmeric powder and a little mustard oil. Spare the paste all over the affected area and cover it with a bandage. Repeat two to three times daily for several days. Alternatively, apply antibiotic cream containing curcumin on the tender area and bandage the tube. Reapply for two to three times daily. Also boil one teaspoon of the turmeric in a glass of milk. Drink it twice daily to reduce the pain and speed up the healing process. Number two is tea tree oil. The antiseptic nature of the tea tree oil can help to relieve the pain and reduce the risk of infection due to an ingrown toenail. Put one to two drops of the tea tree oil in one tablespoon of any carrier oil such as olive or coconut oil. Apply it on the ingrown toenails and cover it with a bandage. Do this three times totally until you are satisfied with the result. And do this along with the tea tree oil, lavender oil or spenjo essential oil can also be used. If an irritation occurs after applying the essential oil, stop using it. Number 3 is Indian Lilac. Indian Lilac, also known as neem, has inflammation reducing and pain suppressing properties that can alleviate the pain, inflammation and swelling due to an ingrown toenails. It even reduces the risk of infection and also promotes the healing. Boil a handful of neem leaves in a 4 cups of the water, strain and allow it to cool down a bit. Soak the affected toenail in this solution for 10 to 15 minutes. Make solution dry in the area throughoutly and repeat twice daily. Also before going to bed, apply neem oil on the affected area and leave it overnight and do this daily. Number 4 is trim correctly. To prevent recurrent ingrown toenails, it is important to trim your toenails correctly. Always trim your nails straight across avoiding these two curved shapes to match the shape of your toenail. When trimming, always straight at the edges, not the middle part, and it is usually important to file and nails to get rid of any sharp edges. Always use a good quality nail clipper and a file. Keep your toenails at a moderate length. If you cut too short, they may drip into the skin as the ingrowth ultimately causing an ingrowth toenail. If you cannot trim your toenail properly due to a medical condition, get them trimmed from a professional. Number 5 is Sensible Footwear. When suffering from an injured toenail, wear open shoes too and sandals to provide an affected area to the extra room and allow it to breathe to heal quickly. For wet ingrown toenails, consider wearing sensible footwear. And the reason behind the painful nail problem is wearing a poorly fitting and a tight footwear. Shoe that place too much pressure on the toenails can cause the nail to grow over it and surrounding the tissue. Shoe made of the shoe fabrics with the room is too are also ideal solution. Women should avoid high heels to relieve the pressure on the toenails. Additional tips. Do not wear socks and shoe while at home and this will allow the affected toenail to get exposed to the fresh air to promote the fast healing. Give the affected two to some rest to aid healing. Expect some poking while keep your aid and your feet dry as much as possible. Take care of your feet properly and trim your nails straight across regularly to prevent the such problems. Maintain proper food hygiene by washing your feet regularly and dry them throughoutly. Always wear comfortable and properly fitting shoes. Scrub your feet with a premised stone on a daily basis to prevent the formation of the hard skin and wear only your dead complaint the stocks and change the equals. Inspect the affected area carefully for the signs of infection such as redness, increased pain, swelling and drainage of the path. Diabetic people should also check their feet regularly for the sign of toenail infections. And if an ingrown toenail persists for a couple of weeks or a sure sign of infection, consult a doctor to avoid any complications.